I was given a message from the Lord on December 9th, and then the second part came on December 19th. So I want to read to you the word that the Lord gave to me. So I was praying um, on December 9th, and I heard the words spring forth. And then the Holy Spirit took me to Isaiah chapter 42, verse 9. And it says, Behold, the former things have come to pass, and new things I declare. Before they spring forth, I tell you of them. Then the Lord began to give me this message, and I want to read it to you. The Lord said, I am about to upset the money changers and turn over their tables. For this unjust system of money is over, says the Lord. What has been withheld from the people is being returned, says the Lord. Gold is being returned. Taxes are being returned. Land is being returned. Interest is being returned. All that has been false in the financial industry is being reversed and corrected, says the Lord. What has been a yoke around the necks of people is being broken off, says the Lord. The surf system is over. No longer will banks lord over the people. The banking system is about to change with one flip of a switch, says the Lord. Get ready, my children, for great wealth a wealth I am giving you for my kingdom plans. For those who steward my wealth righteously, I will give more. But for those who do not, it will be taken from you and given to another who will steward it righteously, says the Lord. Goshen will be on display for all the world to see. My people will be distinguished and set apart as they were in Egypt in the ancient days before the Exodus. I have set a seal around my children in these last days, a seal of protection, a seal of provision, and a seal of perfection. Great exploits I have planned for my elect children, and the world will take notice, says the Lord. For this is the season for great exploits, and we see that in, in Daniel 11.32. The people who know their God shall be strong and carry out great exploits. The Lord said, Many all over the world will come into my kingdom. The darkness will get darker, but the light will shine brighter and expose the darkness, says the Lord. Then the second message he gave to me was on December 19th. And the Lord said, there is a newness on the horizon, says the Lord. This newness will spring forth, and I tell you before it happens. Tell my people there is a newness coming. What newness, you ask? What does this newness mean? Let me explain, says the Lord. What I have in store for my people are new things. He said new inventions, new buildings, new homes built, new revelations of heavenly workings, new anointings, new glory, new children birthed into my kingdom, new ways to travel, new ways to farm to produce bumper crops with larger yields, new businesses, new families, new home goings for such as the cycle of life. This is the newness that is coming, says the Lord. For those who are doomsday people and those who are sitting and waiting for a rapture, I say, look for the newness that will spring forth, says the Lord. Behold, the former things have come to pass and new things I declare. Before they spring forth, I tell you of them, says the Lord. Hallelujah.